How's it going? You got Lanai. Welcome to Waipahu, which means gushing water, home of to one of the oldest sugar plantations in the world. Waipahu is a great town, small, quaint, and has some amazing food. It's one of those sugar plantation towns that has this mixture of all these different cultures because of the immigration to Hawaii during the plantation. One of the stops, Tanioka's, one of my favorite places to eat poke and of course get great Hawaiian style food. Let's go check them out. Number five, you gotta try the jumbo shrimp stick. Very good. Probably about four to six pieces of shrimp, all wrapped up in some panko with some unagi sauce. Mm. How is it? Super good. Bakuzono. Shrimp's my favorite. Number four, the ahi patty. One of my favorites from Tanioka's. And we gotta give a shout out to Grandma Tanioka for this recipe. Ooh. Oh no. And of course, one of the local favorites, everyone loves fried chicken, but you have to try their garlic, mochiko, and regular fried chicken. Which one you like? I'm gonna try the mochiko. I'm going Especially garlic. Go? Yes. Mm. Mm. Crispy, crunchy. Oh no. I always say Tanioka's got the best poke That's in the okay. world, and you have to have their poke bowl. They got the award winning volcano alaya poke, and then of course, their signature limo onion poke. Gotta have rice with a bite. My favorite's the onion. Oh, I didn't come. And of course, you can't come to Tanioka's without trying their number one seller, the spicy ahi tempura bowl. This looks Seafood amazing. Tempura. Yes, unagi Wait. sauce. Spicy ahi on top. Oh yeah. Mm. Are you mm. kidding me? The ube halpia pie with a shortbread crust is a must. Okinawa sweet potato meets haupia meets Hawaii's favorite cookie. Make sure you visit Tanioka's in Waipahu. It's been one of the local favorites forever. <laughs> 